Jacob, I had another dream. Did you see this one too? Yeah. I was in a big field, like the one in my last dream, and I saw my village. But then I woke up. Sigh. Uh, I don't think this world has anything like that. I mean, big wheat fields. The only big plants I've seen are a bunch of weird trees. And those balls of moss floating in the water. Wait, is moss even a plant? Say, have you seen a wheat field before, Jacob? Oh, they're really pretty, aren't they? The ones around my village go around for miles. The plants are really tall. Sometimes I can't even see through them. When it's windy out, the wind can make waves in it. It's like an ocean. A food! Oh wait, but there's food in regular oceans too. Like fish or crabs. Never have I been to a real ocean until now, actually. I've been to the ocean? That's really cool, Jacob. I've only seen the ocean on TV before. I never thought I'd get to ride a boat through one. The water back home doesn't glow should have glowy stuff like it like how it is here either. Uh, but I guess it's because the world is already so dark. You know, I used to be scared of the dark, Jacob. It's a little hard to imagine that now, after spending so much time here. But not long ago, I couldn't even go to sleep without a lamp. It's good to get over that. I guess. Otherwise I wouldn't last long here. Then again, I've been carrying around the sun, so it's not too bad. And also, I don't feel scared at all with you guiding me. So, thanks for that. Anyway, maybe we should head home now, Jacob. Or, head out now. Hello there, ladies and gentlemen. Steampunk gentlemen here with more One Shot. It's been a little been a couple days since we last hang out with our favorite little cat girl. But now that we are back, we got a game to play. Oh yeah, I think this was blocked off last time. Oh wait, maybe you have to make the... Because the thing came back on my TV, the symbol. So I think I have to make the light bulb here. So the third one down. Hey. Move this back over. Yeah, and then it makes you can, said you can't see it, but my screen went back to my normal home screen. You saved me. Thank you. I was trapped in there for so long. Are you a are, are you a Lula? You know my name? Wow, the Messiah really does know everything. Actually, I just met your brother earlier. Oh right. Gosh, Calamus must be so worried. Can you bring him to me? You. Lazy bitch. He's your brother. Wait a minute. How did you know I was the uh, messiah? I don't have the sun with me. Your eyes. Huh? They remind me of the sun. Oh. That's why you're a messiah, right? Well, I... A lot of people back in my home have the eyes like mine. Home? World? Yeah. I'm actually from another world, do you see? It's a place where the sun is in the sky, not in a tower. Do you like this world too? I... Yeah. Yay! Calamus kept saying how this world is getting more dangerous by the minute. But that's okay. You're here now. You can make everything better. Yeah. Oh, wait, oh you're, gonna, you're gonna follow me now. Sweet. <laughs> Come along, bird person. <laughs> We shall find thine brother. Hello, robot. Nope, nope. Alright, let's find bigger bird person.
Are you up here? Yep. Calamus! <laughs> Calamus! Alula! You're okay. Thank goodness. <laughs> he sounds like Batman to me. I was trapped inside this room and it was really scary. But then the Messiah saved me. Trapped. In the ruins. Yeah. There's this weird stuff in the door. You know, the floating squares we see next to the ocean sometimes. The stuff you told me to stay away from. What? It's spread to the ruins now. This is good. Don't worry, I didn't touch it. I'm not hurt or anything. Still. If it's any worse, we may have to find somewhere else to live. What is this square stuff exactly? Bad. Anything that touches him just sorta of gets messed up. Whenever you hear people say the world's decaying, that's what they meant. Obviously, you should avoid them too. I will. Uh, I, I will. Anyway, uh, I can't thank enough for rescuing my sister, Savior. Just call me. I can't, I'm getting all these voice mix up. J just call me Nico. Oh gosh. Would it not be rude to call you by name? Huh? Why would it be? Oh. <laughs> Too many voices. Why would it be? I mean, I'm just a kid like you guys. Ah. Oh. Then, we'd like to visit our house, Nico. Yeah! Yay! Let's go! It sounds a little bit like Sayori from the Game Grumps. Uh, play through of Doki Doki Literature Club. Oh shoot! Oh, oh, oh shoot! Looks like we can't get past that block. Ser seriously? Bonk! I'll be up ahead. I have literally never thought of that. You kind of get used to all this debris after living here for a while. Come on, our house isn't far from here. Okay, am I... I don't know, maybe I'm missing something. I thought that only happened during the meta ending, but maybe she does it twice. So, uh, welcome to our home. I know it's not much, but feel free to make yourself comfortable. What did you bring? Ah, there it is! Here, we want you to have this. There's a screenshot for you. Oh, a feather. The edges are glowing yellow. It's a sacred feather. It's a sacred feather from the great prophet. Oh? Yeah. She's this old lady her dad used to know. Her feathers can glow in the dark and she can see into the future. What? Or something like that. She gave one of her feathers to father before she died. Father one that passes down as an heirloom, although... It feels more fitting for you to have it. Uh, are you sure? Totally sure! I think that's what Father would have wanted. Thank you. <laughs> Where's the rest of your shit at? It's mine. Fireflies light up this room. The back room is full of dust and cobweb. Or maybe that's the meta ending place? Oh, by the way, what happened to the sun? I, I left it to someone in the ruins. She says she wanted to feel the sun again before she... Oh, you must be talking about Mice. Is that her name? She's a powerful plant spirit. She used to protect the Glen. But once the sun died, her health rapidly deteriorated. Oh, I'm glad you were able to find her in time. I think we might already be too late to save her. I know, but I'm glad she got to see the sun again. It's gonna be home again. I hope the squares don't spread too fast. Alright. That's all they wrote. Hey! I saw you go to the courtyard. So I thought I'd tag along. Same. It's a ball. That's mine. It doesn't bounce around as much as you used to, though. Fish! Or oh, fish! Fish! <laughs> Water. Maybe.
maybe something pops up here. Oh, it's been a while. It looks like it used to lead somewhere. Yeah, it's sacred grounds. It's been a while since we went there. We don't have a way of getting there now, remember? There isn't a boat and none of us can swim, man. What's what's the sacred grounds? It's where our people are buried. Sometimes we go there to visit mom. Well, our grave anyway. Oh, uh, wait, how did you get there? I thought you said there isn't a boat. Oh, our friend helped us. He has sort of a machine that allows him to fly. Sometimes he takes us along. But, like I was about to say, we haven't seen him around for a while. I wonder when he'll come back. I wish we can go see Mom again. Come on, Lula. Let's go back to the courtyard now. Okay. Talk to me. Oh, are you leaving now? Good luck, Tico. We believe in you. Oh, you leaving now? It was nice to meet you. Really, thanks for everything. Yep. Alright, that's enough bird people for one episode. Oh, no, no, it's still... I still gotta go back to the main village and do that little thing over there. You, 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 you. Would you like to help me herd my rams? Which is a great reward in store for you, I promise. Uh, yes. Excellent. To the south is a peninsula inhabited by my rams. They're all standing in unfortunate spots. You need to move them onto the darker moss. If you get stuck, ring a bell and they'll return to their positions. Good luck. First try, let's go! Ram Whisperer. You provide a great service for all Ram kind. In return, take this fine Ram wool. Oh, uh, thanks. Alright, so I'm gonna assume I can trade that. Um. It's not the ruins, right? Oh, uh, it's right here. It's right here. Hey, uh, you here to trade? What are you buying? What are you trading? Yeah, take this, uh, wool. I, I think I have something I'd like to trade. You'll take wool, right? What can this wool get me? Wool, huh? That'll get you this fine vial of... I'm not sure what this is, actually. Some sort of fabric dye? Hmm, how about it, Jacob? Um, wait, I could... Wait, you wanna haggle? Really? Alright then. Jacob said they want a better offer. Holy smokes! Forgot I was doing a trade with God, with God for a second there. Okay, okay. Also throwing his commander t-shirt. Yes. Pleasure doing business. I don't know what the most you can get it. <laughs> I heard Rand's like as long as his t-shirt. For dying wool. Alright. I'm pretty certain I can't trade the amber or. Oh, yeah, I think I need three things to make that work. Can I put the feather back? I guess not. Oh yeah, I have a feather. Put, put, 
I can wait. <laughs> yeah. I saw in a picture book once. There we go. That worked out. I got a T-shirt too. I found a pen. Sort of. Or sort of. Indeed, you do. But are you f not forgetting something? Oh, the sun. Yeah, you, 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 you right. You right. He is right. That might be a little important for the game. Oh, she's super dead. She's gone. Oh, there's something on the ground here. Looks like a kernel of corn? She must have left it behind. The, the, light, the light's gone out. Jacob, do you know what happened? No. You, really? But, but, oh, what am I gonna do? Lit up again? Phew. Nico, you broke the sun. Why would you do that? Okay, can I do anything with the corn? Can I plant it somewhere? Or do I need that till the very end? Can't remember. I found something to write with. I, I think you know. I found a pen, sort of. Please write your name here. Please write your own name here. Good luck. All right, did it. Oh, can't go back. What in the world? Chasing me. Oh, another screenshot there. Ah, the sun. Hello, Messiah. Welcome to the refuge. Do you understand what you must do here? I'm supposed to go inside the tower, right? I've already seen the tower. I guess we just must be close. Where's the entrance? On the surface. The surface? Look down, small one. Ooh, pretty high up. I guess I could get down lost stairs. Or find an elevator. Correct. However, the tower is a sacred place. Finding the entrance may be easy, but that alone would not be enough. What do you mean? Once you reach the surface, I recommend visiting the library before it leads. Alright. Thanks. Thank you. Off you go then. I wish you luck. I'm afraid this area is off limits for you. Only the bear of the sacred kernels permit access to the garden. Oh, but, hey, guess what I got. I'm afraid. Oh, like a kernel of corn? I have this. It was left behind by the plant lady in the glen. That is indeed the kernel. Then it is your duty to regrow her. Do you understand what you must do? Yes. Good. Now you may pass through here to access the garden. Good thing I got that vial of water. Look at us go gamers. Time to put the seed in the planter. There's no dirt in the pot. What? Will the seed really grow like this? I can't just put water on the seed. It needs dirt before we water it. 
Alright, guess I'll... Pretty certain there wasn't any dirt earlier. You hear that? Or I have royally messed up. Which would be bad. <laughs> they might want to trade a t-shirt for a pot of dirt. Come on! Come on! Work already! Huh? What was that? Come on! Come on! I'm too busy for this! Uh, uh excuse me? Whoa! You're you! Ah, oh, jeez, I think I was gonna run into. This is embarrassing. Uh, is there uh, anything I can help you with? Yes, please. I'd like to know how to get to the surface. Yeah, I was afraid you were gonna say that. Right now, the elevator is the only way to access the surface, but. Yeah, just take a look at it. It, it looks like an elevator. Well, you're not wrong, but. Go look at the button. Huh, there aren't any buttons. Yep, that's the problem. There's usually a big button here that says ground on it. You know, because it takes you to the ground area. But now it's been ripped out or something? I tried looking everywhere for it, to no avail. Maybe it exploded. Do you think we'll make a new one? What? How? We'll figure it out. I'm the messiah, bitch. I just can't do this. Hey, bed. We'll go back there in a bit. Give me some milk and pancakes. Oh, hi there. Hello. How come uh, hey woo? How come there aren't any people here? Normally cafes have tons of people. Yeah, it's a really slow day. Do you think it's cause the ground access elevator is broken? So I've been told. The city's infrastructure's been suffering a lot lately. Skywalks and stairs breaking off left and right. Now the only reliable way to transport are those elevators. Till now anyway. An empty coffee tin. I probably need that to get the, the soil. You know, the tall guy came in here earlier saying the same thing. He asked me if I see a button that says ground on it. He looked pretty stressed, so I wanted to cheer him up. I told him the only ground I see today is coffee grounds. He, um, he didn't get it. I see him around a lot, but he never seems to have time to eat a proper meal. He just kind of rushes here, drinks a whole pot of coffee, then rushes back out. That's a mood, man. That is a mood. He, uh, he really he takes his job to the extreme. I mean, it's an important job, but nothing's worth the amount of stress, I think. What does he do? Maintenance, I believe. Something to do with the lights, but I don't know the details. Maybe you can ask him later. A coffee machine. It's nearly full. Milk and sugar. I like both. But not in coffee. Uh, bitch! <laughs> Nico, you wanna fight? Oh, you're still here. Would you, um, like anything? I can cook some for you if you want. It's alright, thank you. No, you want pancakes, I know you do. You love pancakes. I had a short stack earlier, it was pretty, pretty good. Hit the spawn. To the save room. Check out over here.
The door is locked for me inside. I think that's meant for the secret ending. Locked. I am a robot. Are you an intruder? Because if you are, I, Model X 8XM, home security bot, TM, serial number 39232B839W4, will have to report you. Oh, sorry. I just kind of walked in the door because it was unlocked. Do you want me to leave? Scanning for suspicious activity. Suspicious activity detected. Zero. I guess as long as I don't do anything bad. Jacob, someone lives here. Kids are sleeping in their bed. It's off. Turn it on. I am still monitoring you. Alert level has been set to low. Don't worry, I promise to be a good guess. A landscape painting. An abstract painting. Alright. For home security, but you think you'd lock the door. Okay. A riveting conversation. It's a big penguin plush. Hello, hello, penguin. Hello. I forgot about that. <laughs> hello, penguin. Hello. 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 It's a pink. It's a pink flower. Give me the dirt. She doesn't talk. He, he, hello. Would you like to play a game? Oh, sure. What game would you like to play? Hmm. Do you know rock, paper, scissors? Desire difficulty level. Huh? Desire er, duration of turns. Uh, please set your timer. Never mind. My parents are like literally never home. I don't mind. I'm used to it. Besides, I got a model CWT second gen unit 4E here to keep me company now. I got a, I got a deep voice for a woman. She, she still talks a little weird sometimes, but that's okay. She's learning. If I work real hard, she might even be tame someday. I keep I keep hearing that word. What, what tame? Mm-hmm. Nobody's told me what it means yet. That's just a robot thing. I can't really explain it either. Uh... How about hide and seek? Desire difficulty level. Well, maybe not too easy? Initiating. <laughs> Initiating ruthless mode. Target. Locked. You have exactly 14 seconds. Start running. <laughs> I'm not sure if I want to play anymore. Oh, uh, maybe there's a screenshot to that. Close up her face. Oh. Session. Abort. Are you feeling unwell? It's, no, it's not that. Uh, I'll pass. A, pot, a pile of large books. One of them's a robot instruction manual. It's kind of sad. Four robots playing cards. Picture of many ones and zeros. What are you here for? I just moved here from the Glen. Things are so different in the city. You've been to the Glen, right? Yeah. Everything's so green back there. I really miss it. My neighbor gave me some plants to cheer me up, but... I should probably get a muzzle for Betsy there. There are remains of a pod plant. Can I have the dirt, please? It's a Roomba. I'm not sure what this is. It's like a little car. You should ride it. What? D do it! Um. <laughs> That's so cute. 
It's off. Oh, he can speed up. Jacob Sullivan's here. Does, does it like run on batteries or? Oh, that was fun. Give me dirt. <laughs> Hello there. Gerald Kenobi. You have a lot of pot. Yeah, you have a lot of plants. I do. Grew all these myself, you see. Feel free to ask me about them. Oh, you're a gardener, right? Yep. Do you happen to have any dirt? For growing plants, I mean. Yep. Do you need some? Yes. I'm supposed to plant this seed left behind by a plant lady. But the pot in the garden doesn't have any soil. I see. I know who you're talking about, yeah? We used to date. Here, take this whole bag. Thanks. Cactus. 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 <laughs> That's a phosphor tree. Oh, looks like we saw in the glen. Always wondered, where are the leaves? They're not dead, are they? Oh, not at all. Although these plants are composed of a woody mitt tissue, they're closer to grass, anatomy wise. So the branches are actually leaves? Sorta. That's what's interesting about these plants is the amount of phosphorus slap they can generate. Phosphor, that's the glowy stuff, right? Yep. Phosphor can store light energy and slowly emit it over time. Most of phosphor from the world still contains energy from before the sun went up. We'll have to sun recharge them, though. Well, let's talk about something else. It's wheat! Why is it in a flower pot? Well, doesn't it look nice? I guess. I like to stand in the middle of a wheat field back in my village. It goes on for miles. Ah, wish I could have seen it. In our world, wheat is usually grown in small, isolated plots. Or in a flower pot. This tree has leaves. Ah, uh, yes, true foliage is hard to come by nowadays. You hardly ever see trees like these in the wild anymore. And the ones you do see are pretty much all artificially by people like me, mostly for nostalgic purposes. Empty flower pot. Ah, uh, black clovers. Probably lemon plant hardy enough to survive naturally outside the glen. Personally, I think they're really boring to look at. One of my customers really loves them, though. I think all the black clovers I'm growing are actually for him. Got a thing I haven't seen in a while. I wonder when he's coming to pick these up. Be sure not touch these. Those are plants that have only recently sprouted. It's not easy for a plant to make it out there these days. We got these growing lamps, but they're a poor substitute for the sun. Sweet. Alright. Uh, look down here. Coffee. Coffee cups. I'm too young to drink coffee. Never too young. Coffee machine. It's very warm. Hello? Hey there. Hello! You the messiah? Mm-hmm. Like a scarf. Thank you. Mama made it for me. Tell her I like her needlework. I will. When I see her again. Cool guy. I like his style. The fridge has magnets on it. Maybe they'll come handy? I hope nobody will mind us taking them. Just a trash can. A pile of large books. They look like phone books. I don't know what the magnets are for, but I'm taking them. Scissors. There's a pair of scissors on the ground. On a pile of hair? I don't think anyone's using it anymore, so. Sup, Spencer. A small pod plant. It's gonna die in here. Right. Okay, let's go back and restore Plant Woman. Do I need a or put the dirt in this? 
No. I hope this helps you grow a little seed. The seed's in the soil, but looks a little bit dry. That's why we got water. Good thinking, Jacob. Why don't you have this seed grow? Hmm. The dirt's nice and moist now, but what if it dries out? There's only so much water from this little tube. I'll hold the tube for now, just in case. Uh, we've getting dirt and water, but will that be enough? I guess I need to go get more... More water? I haven't looked over here yet. Good evening. Well, the time of day doesn't really mean anything now. With the sun gone, the night never seems to end. Then, how can you tell? Time, I mean. I have my ways. <laughs> Looks in a mirror, what do you think? You're going to need this soon. Take this film and expose it to the void. The answer will be revealed when you bring it back again. The computer printed out a strange transcript sheet. And expose it. Oh wait, I have to. I have to bring it outside of the computer, like outside my monitor area. Bring it back. Six three zero one four. I'm sure I can get that, but I'm gonna write down just in case. Six three. Oh, I dropped my controller. Yeah, six three zero one four. Oh, thank you. Yep, there's a secret ending stuff right there. Wow. Wow. I've actually never been to a big city before. All these lights, all these people. I guess most of the world's population lives here. Is there anything to the left? It's very different from my village. The village is very small and surrounded by huge fields. I saw a bit of that one in my dream a while ago. The tallest building in our village are only two stories tall. I think this might be just a, it's a big wraparound. What about you, Jacob? Where do you live? Currently, I'm not really in the the city. I definitely, have, I guess so. Someplace else. Something that is in a city or a village, like a ship. Well, maybe not a ship. Can you imagine living in a city like this, though? I can't. It's kind of scary. But also, really cool. I mean, I did live on a ship at one point, so. Yep, just a big wraparound. A heavy piece of metal set into the wall. I think it might be a door or some vault. There's a small screen in the middle. A tape dispenser. It's bolted table. Stapler, it's bolted table. These are bolts so people won't steal them. Feel free to use, though. I am the power room mechanic. Do you have an issue to report? Yeah, actually. The surface access elevator appears to be broken. There's a button missing in. Can you go take a look? Leaving this room is not in my programming. Never mind. Some kind of computer terminal.
want to find more water and get the plant stuff taken care of. Maybe I can get some from him. But don't be afraid. Don't afraid to ask if we do get hungry. I'll be happy to make them for you. Fill, fill it with water. Oh, maybe we make a button out of this. I can cut a, oh, I didn't mean to do this. I can cut a piece of the can and fold it into a rectangle shape. Just like the arts and crafts. I don't think it's supposed to be this simple. How are we going to connect to the elevator? Well, let's find out. The magnets don't stick to the aluminum, but... Oh, will not we just folded the magnets under the, this edge? Hmm, it's holding together, if just barely. I hope that's good enough. Not even what I meant to do, but here we are. Go off. A coffee. I can't just, can, I get, can I get a vial of coffee, please? Right, I can fill the soup with more water here. There we go. We can get dirt and water, but will that be enough? Sun. Hmm. I don't know. Alright, let's hope this works. The button fits snugly, and I can hear the machine powering on. The button completely fell apart. Hey, you tried. Well, well. Do you think you'll be able to make that button? <laughs> Time to kick the door again. My foot hurts. I'm losing so much time. Probably 24 minutes of work already. I hate this. <laughs> you tried. Uh, I should have done this in the first place. Uh oh. Big dummy dumb. Smooth brain. I probably did that before too. Let's hope this works. Reactivating elevator services. Please input security code to continue. What? That's never happened before. The squares? Huh? You saw them, right? They were on the door and... Nah, the square stuff happens all the time. About the whole security code thing. Then again, the elevator hasn't been this broken before. Hmm. I guess we should look for a code, Jacob. I got a code. 63014. What? It works! I don't know what you did, but it actually works! Good job, kid. You're a genius, you know that? I had help from Jacob, too. Oh, great. The whole Messiah business. Anyway, ready to go? I'll be up ahead. I'm going back to the apartments. Most of the plants were all tend to grow in a glen. Even if it's facing a flooding issue, it's still in better condition than the other two areas. The Barrens is, well, the Barrens. And Refuge City has barely enough ground to stand on, let alone grow stuff. On a larger scale than this, I mean. I guess not. Okay. Back to the elevator. Actually, plot twist. We're going ahead and we're going to drop a save. I'm a little tired from walking. Is it alright if I take a nap? Alright. Thank you everybody for watching. Please, like, comment, subscribe if you want to see more of one shot. 
or any of the other playthroughs I got going on this channel. Let me know what you want to see more of. Until next episode, Steampunk out.